Welcome back everyone to another episode of Shea TV. My name is Marissa Hill and today we'll be taking a look at a Nike SB Dunk Low. These are known as the Racers. Let's take a quick sneak peek. back everyone to another unboxing and review if you're joining us for the first time welcome in be sure to hit that subscribe down below and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy these unboxing and reviews and today we are going to be discussing a nike sb dunk low these are known as the races so we'll go through the overview of these jump into size and fit followed by how i style this really fun quirky looking sb dunk then we'll conclude with these are doing currently on the resale market let's jump right into it so for those of you who are big time female skateboarder fans this was definitely probably a nike sb dunk that you had to pick up so this is a collaboration with the skateboarder Raisha leal who is a brazilian skateboarder she pretty much went viral when she was seven years old it was a video of her and this really cute kind of tinkerbell uh, ballet outfit and she did a insane move which was a single heel flip and i still to this day think that is one of the coolest videos for somebody so young uh, and to top it off at 15 she was able to win the silver medal at the tokyo olympics she is now 19 and uh, still is a bit of a prodigy when it comes to skateboarding and this sneaker is all about pretty much who she represents so as far as the upper goes we've got a smooth white clean leather for the toe box and we've got this really just cool abstract uh looking pattern in beige and gray then on the bottom for a cute little lace toggle we do get these really cute smiley faces so it's in this blue gold and purple and yellow tone and that is very representative of Raisha, which most will say that she is a very infectious bubbly happy personality then we've got white laces that i currently have this tied with but you do have the option with this purple or blue if you do want to add a bit more pop of color as far as the top of the tongue goes we've got this pop of light purple and then nike sb is in white and then we do have races dunk uh nicely put underneath that nike branding and then on the back we do have that smiley face that you see as well on those lace toggles let's take a look at those details then move along to the side paneling Wrapping around to the side panels, we are still getting some more of those smiley faces printed this time in a debossed effect on the white leather. Then we have overlays of this tumbled uh, leather in a navy tone and that same abstract print, which works its way to the back of the heel. Nike is embroidered in blue. And then as we wrap around to the lateral side of the sneaker, you're actually getting a different color for the Nike swoosh, this time in the purple shade on the tumbled leather. And then again, the same patterns of the smiley faces in the abstract beige and gray finish 
for the rest of the sneaker. Then on the interior, more smiley faces, this time in silver. And then we've got a Nike SB in silver, and then the insole is in that beautiful pop of purple. The sneaker is then completed with a gum bottom and a white midsole. Let's take a look at those last and final details and jump into size and fit. size and fit goes, I always size up in my Nike SB Dunks by half a size just because you do get this additional padding on the tongue as well as some additional padding on the heel. So do take that into consideration when deciding on what size range will work best for you. All right, so now let's talk about styling. Again, this is such a really fun and quirky sneaker. I feel like this is going to be a perfect color combination for the springtime, for the summertime. So for the first look, I kept it pretty casual to kind of implement some just simple tones into the mix So this was a standout piece. For the first look, I decided to wear a sleeveless vest in gray and then I wore some just simple denim bottoms. decided to match the blue hues that I saw in the sneaker itself. So I wore a cropped tank top that was in a crochet material in blue and white, and then some just basic light denim jeans. <laughs> look I decided to wear a denim jacket with a cropped white tank and then some just nice simple white cargo pants <laughs> So now 
let's talk about how these are currently doing on the resale market. So these retailed at $125 and they're currently going between $175 to $215. So definitely a little bit of resale on these, not too crazy, uh, but a really just altogether different and cool looking Nike SB Dunk collaboration. All right, everyone, that is it for this unboxing and review. If you join us for the first time, thank you so much. My name is Marissa Hill. This is Shade TV. We'll catch you on the next episode.